All right, so this is my Larva Neji build. Uh, I have replaced his four with Larva. It's Nidus ability, and uh, I have a lot mostly tankiness. I do have some range and efficiency, and a little bit of duration. And Safeguard is really good because uh, you can put this on your companions. You can put this on your allies. You can put you, your three. Uh, uh, you can also put this on defensive, like an arbitration, a defense arbitration, and you have to defense the guy. You can just put this on him, um, and it's really nice. So, uh, which which is I like this segment a lot. And the thing I was doing in the video is that I would put all the enemy together. I would hit them with the blazing chakra, and blazing chakra have a chance of dropping orbs. All the enemy who gets hit by the by the blazing chakra when they're on fire, if they die. They drop. They have a chance of dropping additional orbs, and it's really fun because uh, you have all the enemy together, and it's really easy to hit them with the chakra, and they will be dropping so many orbs left and right. And that's the build I was going for uh, for my melee. It's uh, same thing. I mostly use my primary weapon. I'm using the Daikubo for the Nikana augment, and for my uh, weapon, I'm using the Za, which is the Nikana Za. And uh, yeah, that's the build. It was actually pretty fun. Uh, the synergy between larva and it's so easy to hit all the enemies when they're all together with chakram. Anyways, that's the build.